Hello, first graders. It's Mrs. Davis here with your Patterns of Power grammar lesson for today, Wednesday, February 10th. All right, remember our goal this week is I can change a verb to an adjective by adding ing to the end. So remember, when we do that, when we take a verb and add ing at the end, we want to make sure that we place it before a noun so that we have an action adjective. For example, a snake slithers through rustling leaves and climbs up into a tree. We know rustling has been taken from a verb, turned into an adjective by adding ing to the end, and placed right before the noun, leaves. Rustling describes how the leaves sound. Now it's gone from being a verb to an adjective. Let's see, can you spot the action adjective in the sentence today? The sleeping cat is curled up in the sun. Hmm, Ms. Davis took a verb, added ing, and turned it into an adjective. Can you spot the adjective? I bet you said sleeping. Very good, sleeping. Sleep was the verb. I made it an adjective by adding ing and placing it before the noun cat. Sleeping describes the cat. All right, how about this next one? Can you spot the action adjective in the sentence? The barking dog is happy to see us. Mm, Miss Davis took a verb and turned it into an adjective. Yeah, it was the word barking. So bark was the verb. I added ing and describing the dog. So right before the noun dog, the barking dog. How about this next one? Can you spot the action adjective in the sentence? The flying butterfly soared above the flowers. Hmm, looking for a verb that has become an adjective. Did you spot flying? Yes, fly was the verb. I added ing, placed it before the noun butterfly. The flying butterfly. All right, last one. The crying baby is tired. Hmm, can you spot the action adjective in the sentence? The crying baby is tired. Oh, I know how you feel, baby. That's right, crying. Cry was the verb, added ing. Crying describes the baby, how the baby is acting. They are crying. All right, great job spotting the action adjective in my sentences today. As you write today, see if you can include an action adjective in your writing. Hmm, maybe you can work it in to one of your writings. All right, friends, so remember, I can change a verb to an adjective by adding ing to the end. Have fun with those action adjectives, and Ms. Davis will see you tomorrow. Bye.